to day two, our first sea day. This is our view right outside our balcony. That's pretty cool. We could see the wake of the ship right just by looking right. So very cool. But it's breakfast time. I think we're gonna do the brunch for the first day. Wind jammer tomorrow. So let's go get some food. the dining room for brunch. We missed the wind jammer. A little bit of a migraine issue this morning, so late it is. Yeah, the wind jammer closed at 11, so it's 11. about 11.15 now. <laughs> yeah, 11.15. Luckily, I looked on the app and it said the restaurant was open for brunch till noon. So, this is, and it's very nice in here. Look at this. Yeah. And we can see the ocean down there. This is deck three. So we're very low. <laughs> and it's very empty. Yeah, and good coffee. Juice and pastries on the way. <laughs> right. And we're watching the pups. I got <laughs> eggs <laughs> your way and crispy bacon, a hash brown, and I got white toast. So it looks lovely. And Andy and I are going to split um, blueberry pancakes. Blueberry pancakes in the middle, yeah. And then I got an omelet, peppers, ham, cheese, uh, and bacon, and a hash brown. It looks wonderful. Good? And we're hungry. So we're gonna eat this and then we're gonna figure out, maybe go on deck, watch some Flow Rider people. We can't do Flow Rider, but we'll watch and show you. Okay, this looks cool over here. Look at this. Oh, is this the cupcakes? Oh, nice big theater. All right, now deck five up one deck. Fitness center is actually outside. That's interesting. So deck five, there's a full jogging lap lane. You say to the left. <laughs> Fitness center that way. Slow and fast. Slow, thank you. Fitness center, 6 a.m., 9 p.m. Oh, Stairmaster. And they all have, all the uh, treadmills have a nice view of the ocean. Rover! Oh my goodness! Good boy! Boy? Yeah, good boy. Oh, so soft. We just stumbled upon him. Oh, uh, he's got this little area over here. That's awesome. We found Rover. Oh my goodness. We're deck five promenade. Very amazing. Look at this. Bar where we finally picked up our tumbler and 
got, yeah, they're two different colors, so we know who's his who. Mine's going to be like the little purplish colored one, and Andy's is like a goldish. And it's kind of shimmery when you move it. So we yeah. also picked up a uh, little mimosa and Bloody oh, Mary. Yeah, so cheers. And it's past noon, so. And a bunch of olives. Yeah, look at that jackpot of owls. It's like eight of them. Ooh. So there you go. But yeah, so you have to go to the bar, uh, Schooner Bar or Bolero's Bar to get your tumblers. So yep. we've seen on some ships they put them in your cabin, but you just got to go get them. Yeah. All right, we just stepped out deck seven, Surfside. Our cabin, I think, is right up there. But deck seven with the carousel has the arcade. Let's check out the arcade. This is the arcade on Icon of the Seas. It's a little smallish. There's only a few. Yeah, it's a small, small area. But they do have Ski Ball, Super Mario, or no, Mario Race. Yeah. That looks cool. So in the same area, they have Surfside Bites. And this to me is looking like it's complimentary, not seeing any pricing. So look at fruit, hamburgers, hot dogs. Ooh, are those churros? Churros. Are they churros or are they like salted covered? They look, are pretzel. Churros or pretzels? All right, so we're gonna have to check that out. Oh. Cinnamon sugar churros. Oh. Yeah, cinnamon sugar churros. Pier 7 has more food. We haven't checked that out. Here's the bar we tried on the first day. We like this little bar. Mike is doing sexy man contest. Right, He's got this. We know. All right, you got it. Wow. Audience participation. We're going to uh, ask you guys to name third, second place, and of course, world's sexiest man. All right, then, here we go. He says his best asset uh, are his dance moves. His We're about to find out. His dance moves. Ladies and gents, go crazy for Mike. Yeah. off to see what the final judges review. Third place went to this gentleman and Mike got second place and this is where Betsy and I decided that Mike had the most cheers and the highest votes. We feel he was robbed. But first place did go to the man on the end. He seemed to have the loudest cheers. So all in all, fun time. All right, we're at the Schooner Bar. Look at this. Toasted marshmallow, old-fashioned. Uh, lavender daiquiri, so. I am trying the lavender daiquiri. Oh, that's really good. All right, taste lavender-y. Mm, it's good. 
with our all about sports trivia. So if you want to join in, you soapy. can take your favorite <laughs> No, that's well. soapy. Hello, everybody. It is formal night, and finally brought the gold dress back from. What was that? The glory. That was back Carnival in... Carnival Magic, probably. Yeah, Magic and Glory Days. So, and even Dream. <laughs> yeah, so we're heading in uh, 5 o'clock early for us, but we're going to pop in, see what's for dinner, and then mosey around the ship, so... Yeah, but everyone, tell her how good she looks in the gold. Holy cow. No, I just told them right like before the this, I'm done with formal. <laughs> <laughs> Caesar salad. Caesar that salad. Looks fantastic. Yeah, and you got the little shredded what is that parm there? Yeah, all over it. Yeah. yeah. Looks great. I have French onion soup. Look at the size of that crouton on top. I'm not sure how I'm gonna get through there, but yeah, that looks really good. It is lobster night. Look at those little guys. Yeah, and then it's like, um, what do they call it? Is that a, a scallop? No, um, it was a potato fondant. All right, just real quick, I gotta say, this might be the best lobster I've ever had. It's like, it has like a garlicky, creamy sauce on it, and you don't really need the butter, but of course, it's always good with butter. But it's tender, perfectly cooked. This is really, really good. Better than last night's at Hook. Very good. And even though we're full, desserts arrived. What is it? It is warm apple cobbler and ice cream. It, it looks, looks really good. It does. But I'm so full already. You got this. But At least, you know, part of it. Oh boy. With or without ice cream? I'm going to try without first. Okay. No cordial. It was server recommended as the best dessert. And I got the same thing, so I'll give it a go. But yeah, dinner tonight was really good. Uh, lobster, fantastic. Uh, French onion soup, really good. Um, so yeah, we can't complain about the main dining room dinner. All right, a little loud, but we have two toasted marshmallow old fashions. So we'll see how these are. You have giant ice cream and marshmallows. Smooth. That's not bad. And it's not too like uh, bitter. I'm not sure. <laughs> She's thinking on it. It's not bad. I bet the marshmallow is good. <laughs> Here's Central Park at night. It looks really nice. Andrea walking in her gold glitteries. I'm, I'm holding my dress down so I don't have any Marilyn Monroe moments. Holy cow, everybody. Look at this. This is just awesome. Alright, here's Travel Scouts doing their thing, getting a glamour shot. Look at this. Very royal. <laughs> you should. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The princess way. <laughs> yeah. <All right. laughs> It is, and it's got the little royal logo. All right, so just had an espresso martini made. It has a little foam on top and coffee beans. This martini is one of the best martini on the ship. That's what we've oh, just okay. were told. Okay. Yeah, and we walked right over to get it. Yes. Okay, Andrea has the Carilio. Carilio. 
Carilio, Carilio. cold brew coffee, and liqueur. Uh, and then I have. Uh, it's right. really good though. These here, cheers. These are fantastic. We may. We're glad we found this on day two and not day six. Yes, now. Yes. <laughs> That's very good. Okay, so behind the Aquadome, we found like a hidden area. <laughs> yeah. Does everyone know it's here? Apparently it's called the Overlook. Yeah. Oh yeah, so then during the day, all of these windows is just gonna face the water. Yeah, that's so, so cool. So we gotta check that out during the day. <laughs> and look at that. An aquarium. In this bar, Nobody is even back here hardly. That's so crazy. Yeah, this is pretty amazing. Mm. Overlook spritz. There's all these crazy little seating areas here. And like, <laughs> you climb the steps. And see on an angle here, you can see the water. So during the day. Yeah, I don't know if this will come out, but you can see the water in front. And you could climb the staircase, and there's a private there's seating, seating area up like up there. there. And there is here, too. Someone was sitting there. Sorry about that, folks. <laughs> <laughs> and you get a few steps on a ship this big. This is the life. It's the Royal Caribbean kind of life. <laughs> <laughs> ah. There we go. Come back for me in about an hour. <laughs> Starburst, a cosmic ballet of creation where new matter and wondrous elements are born. A celestial being emerging from the brilliance of a thousand suns. We have made it to day two, and last night went to bed with a pretty good migraine. Did not sleep well, woke up, still had the migraine, so uh, we were kind of bummed. We thought we missed breakfast at the wind jammer, but luckily for the wind, the main dining room had a brunch, which was fantastic. After brunch just kind of relaxed for a little bit we saw mike participate and he should have been the winner but came in second for the sexy man competition and uh we had dinner uh formal night at main dining room probably the best formal night dinner 
we've had on a cruise ship. We got to see the ice skating show afterwards called Starburst, which that was wild, crazy. And then just met up with friends afterwards. So day two is in the books and we are looking forward to another sea day for tomorrow. So let's see what happens.